Make full proof of your ministry. Push yourself to the limit. Don't be a softy. In 1937, Walt Disney came out with his first full feature cartoon, Snow White. Disney artists had produced over a million paintings. And each of those paintings lasted one twenty-fourth of a second on the screen. And I received gospel tracts that I don't think have ever been road tested, let alone proofread, that I confess are as cold as my heart is sometimes. As if anything will do. I mean, if we ran our businesses the way we do the work of God sometimes, I think we'd go bankrupt. God isn't looking for people who have the odd weekend now and again free. They may be able to fit him in, you know, if nothing else comes up. He's not interested in people who take on the Great Commission as a hobby. He's looking for young people and older people too who say, well, Lord, compared to you, I'm not much. But with a combination here, me being the empty vessel and you being the treasure inside, I think maybe you can use me. And I want you to use me. And I'm prepared to pay the price, whatever it takes, so that at the end of my day, I can write as my epitaph the words of a young missionary who on his way to China didn't make it. He, he died in Egypt. And he wrote these words to his friends and family at home. No reserve. No retreat. No regrets. Love, Bill. <laughs> and if at the end of our day we want that kind of a, an epitaph, I tell you, it will take some surgery, won't it? There is one who has a prior claim to my life, and if I love anything more than him, I'm not living in a worthy manner. <sighs> oh, that God would grip our hearts and make us realize that it's, it's not a party, it's not a picnic, it's a war. There's a battle to be fought, there's a victory to be won, and God has given us marvelous equipment. He's given us far-reaching authority based on his word to go out and invite everyone we see to come to heaven with us, and if they agree to come, he'll receive them into everlasting habitations. It's astounding when you think of it, isn't it? But this I say, brethren, the time is short. For the fashion of this world is passing away.